What is up guys, my name is COD Gameplay and today I have a match of Domination on launch. I'm using the Commando with the Dual Mags, Flak Jacket, Tactical Mask, and Sleight of Hand Pro. Sadly, I still don't have my Tactical Mask Pro. I'm working on it. I gotta work on it, get some more Nova Gas kills. Once I get that, Tactical Mask Pro will be the bomb. But my end score is actually 62-6 and six on Domination Ground War and... Most of it was actually with my gun. I believe I got one chopper gunner, which got me five kills. So other than that, it was all gun kills. I maybe might have had dogs. I can't remember. This was this was about a week ago. But I believe I went on a 22 gun streak. And you guys can watch this. How I, I just kite these guys. I go always staying behind cover, trying to stay to the outside of the map. I wait for them to come to me. Always have my left trigger aim down sights before them because they're running out. They're trying to get out of their spawn, so they're running. They're already at a disadvantage. I'm just sitting there picking them off one by one by one. And you notice this spot. I thought that he saw me, so I backed out. And then when I realized he didn't, I popped up. That was a risky move, really risky move, but it actually paid off. Usually I don't do that, but as you see, sadly, me going into there, someone knew I was going into there and pre-fired me. So... I lost a gunfight. What can you do about that situation? So what I want to talk about today was the new map. Or not the new map. New map packs are coming out tomorrow. Oh crap, I need to get on that. But the new game mode is called Express Playlist. It is amazing. It is so great. Like, finally, they have came out with this. When I saw that they released the new Express Playlist, it was like an angel up in the sky. The Call of Duty angel just, just gave everyone a blessing taking out ghost and second chance from the playlist if you guys don't know what that is a new playlist has been released on xbox today nine hours ago or yesterday for you guys because i'm doing this commentary the night before and what the actual playlist is it has no second chance and no ghost so now we have nothing to complain about trader is like hey we gave you this now you guys stop bitching and complaining and just play the game properly okay so I, I, I guess people like Thunder and some other people, you know, I even, I even complain about Second Chance. I will complain. I'll get blo blop shotted. If you guys know what blop shotting is, check out Thunder Toro or Legend of Thunder. <laughs> He's the king of the blop shots. Getting blop shotted, as you could say. Blop shot, blop shot, automatic drop shot. What kind of shooter rewards you when he got shot? So what a blop shot is, when someone goes down into last stand, they have a certain period of invincibility. And they can't be killed. So while they're dropping down, they keep their primary for that split second. And that bullet goes through you, kills you, and they go into the last stand. Ball scratch mode. It's kind of annoying. And to not have that in this new playlist is absolutely amazing. Finally, you don't have to get destroyed by those little cheap tactics. And Ghost. Okay, we complain about Ghost. But there's two sides of this, okay? Ghost makes it so people can't appear on UAV and chopper gunners. So personally, I don't like Ghost because I get those kill streaks, and Ghost prevents me from getting better better games. It really does, and I'll die by it sometimes. But I think we complain about Ghost a little bit too much. It's kind of a it's a bit of an overpowered uh, perk because the only thing that really counters Ghost is Blackbird. But it was so funny because when I popped on here first, the first game that I played. The whole other team had Ghost. If you do actually try writing Ghost in Express Playlist, it won't work. It'll make your perk uh, not available. You'll have no perk for first slot. So it's a, it's a huge waste. It's really kicking the ass for them. And it's really funny to watch as they like struggle with no first perk. And you're just kind of destroying them. So it's great. But one thing that I think are a little bit bad about it is that, you know what? really good players go into the Express Playlist. It's not really bad, I guess you could say. It, it makes it for a more competitive game type. And it can be fun, actually, to have more competition. But it can also be sometimes frustrating because, you know, you're trying to get that gameplay, you're trying to get that rush style. Because if you're playing against really good players, rushing, like, usually, like I'm doing right now this game, I'm playing pretty aggressive, I'm trying to get lots of kills to make it entertaining, right? And so, it's kind of difficult to make an entertaining gameplay when... You are versing absolute beast. So I don't know. Would you guys rather see like really close games where I have like a three KD, four five KD? Like I'll go maybe forty and nine, but I don't. I don't like posting that because it's only like a four KD. I play really aggressive. I cap maybe six flags, defend four, and we win the game by twenty points. Something like that. It's it's entertaining to say the least. 
and I think the Express playlist will be a nice refresh from people that, you know, before you rage quit the game, you pop on there for a little bit, you add some more skill into the game, and you can actually play the game properly, right? And so I'd suggest everyone that has Black Ops, even if you're not playing it right now, go give it a try. Go give the Express playlist a try. If you're a sniper, you will adore this new playlist because you don't need to get the hit markers going into the last stand or even the triple hit markers. It's happened every it's happened to everyone that sniped. You get the one hit marker, the two hit marker that puts them in the last stand and then they kill you. It's the worst feeling in the world. So now that last stand is gone in that one playlist, it is I can't, I can't say that enough. I've already said it like tons of times, but it's great. The one thing about having no ghost is that UAV and counter UAV are so important now. Everyone needs to ride it. I, I swear. If you do not have counter UAV and UAV both equipped as your killstreaks, you are hurting your team because a constant UAV knowing exactly where the other team is with no ghost, there's there's nothing all you do is look at your mini map the whole entire game. You know exactly where the other team is. If you have a counter UAV, you're at a major advantage because not only do you see where they are, they can't see where you are. Even if they have those UAVs up, it'll counter it and it's great great fun but sometimes you know they have the strellas out the one thing is most people that don't have ghost they don't have their strella class on right the most the, the most average class that has ghost and or the most average class that has a strella um will actually have ghost on it as well and so they won't pick it because you know a ghost is not available in this playlist so what's the point in using it right and so it it makes for more entertaining more kill streak kills and I guess to some extent that could be not the best for YouTube because people don't really love seeing killstreak kills, right? You like watching some gun one-on-one -on -one gunfights, maybe some quad feeds in there, rushing around and exciting gameplays. Maybe what do you guys like more? Like exciting gameplays or great scores? Because Fear Crads and the Mark of J and like Ronaldinho, they all get both. And not a lot of people can do that. I, I have to say. Like Wings of Redemption, he plays a bit more passive, so if you want an aggressive style Maybe you maybe you don't go to him for that type of gameplay. Although if you want to want to see good scores, you can guarantee Wings of Redemption will have those good scores all the time because he's a very solid player. But another tip that I actually would have for Treyarch is make some more Express playlists. Maybe turn this is a thought. Maybe try making Express a you know how they have core, they have ground war. Maybe try making it one of those. I don't know, just a thought. That might be too drastic of a change for them. And you notice how I skip this, I only get 5 kills and I go from 53 to 58 kills if you didn't know. And so maybe you have like a uh, Express TDM, an Express Ground War, Express uh, Mosh Pit, and then an Express Domination. That would be absolutely the greatest idea. I don't know how much effort that would put in to put to actually physically do that. Because personally, I don't really like, like playing Headquarters uh, with uh, the Express playlist because... If I get a headquarters game, it takes a th it'll honestly be a 12 minute game, guaranteed. Guaranteed it'll be a 12 minute game. And so it can it can get difficult because if, even if you do really good in a headquarters game, I can't commentate over a 12 minute game. I can, but the chances are most people won't want to watch something that is over 10 minutes, right? Even 9 minutes. I usually don't like to push it this far because the average person likes to see like a 30 second clip, right? And for that reason, I have another channel. If you guys are already this far and you already haven't subscribed to Sexy Cod Shots, I have a second channel. It is Sexy Cod Shots. Link will be in the description. And I post every day crazy clips and I commentate over them. So it's my commentary, your guys' clips. And combined, it is a community channel of sorts. So, anyways, I am Cod Gameplay. Hope you guys enjoyed. Go check out the Express playlist and I'll catch you later. Peace.